Happy Valentine's Day, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> what a great day. Now, it's one of the nation's favourite cuisines. And now, oh, sorry, I just dribbled. <laughs> sorry. It's all good. Great I don't look, know what's <laughs> great look. happened to me. It's in the bag already. I'm OK. Uh, so, listen. In. <laughs> what am I saying? Well, apparently, listen to this, guys. <laughs> Apparently, a bowl of pasta oh, has declared the food that makes everybody happy. <laughs> 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 that makes everybody <laughs> happy. Exactly. The food. What do you think? Scientists are saying that saying it, it makes you happy. What, do we've you been, agree? We've been telling everyone for years it's the most romantic and sexiest food yeah. in the world. That's um, why we're all happy because we eat pasta every day. Yeah. Exactly. Give yeah. me that pasta, that's right. what I say. But to help Give serve up our bowl of happiness, we are welcoming two new faces. Yeah. You might have seen them already. Next to Miss Alison Hammond, twin brothers Tony and John Alberti. Morning to both of you. Oh. Morning. Happy Morning. Valentine's Day. Happy nice Valentine's Day. So lovely to, to meet you. Which yeah. one's which then? I'm John. That's I'm Tony. John and Tony. Good morning, I'm yeah. Tony. All right, we'll le let you do your thing. Yeah, so first up, we're going to be doing our spaghetti alla puttanesca. OK? That's me. Yeah, That's so me. what we love about our Italian recipes, they always have a great story behind them. And puttanesca means in Italian, means ladies of the night, shall we say. So Ooh. this originated back okay. in the mid 20th century um, in Naples. And the ladies used to cook this recipe and using all the fragrant ingredients, they used to open the windows and the shutters. Really? And they'd let it out into the streets of Naples, into the town, to attract the men. And that's how they got the business. They always wow. say... This is a true story. Uh, um, making it up. The way to a man's heart is through exactly. his stomach. Well, yeah, they say the that, Italians they? created that. We yeah. invented romance. It's true. Yeah, exactly. It's true. Yeah. OK, so we'll just start off with the pasta. So with every Italian love story, we start off with the extra virgin olive oil into the pan. Yeah. OK, so with this one, we're going to go with, in with the anchovies. Now, a lot of people don't like anchovies, think it's a strong flavour, but yeah. we're going to break these down into the oil and they'll dissolve into the oil, so you won't actually taste them really. It's just going to be a background flavour. They're going to add that richness to it and saltiness and like savoury flavour into that. Okay. Then so you do, in... if you don't like anchovies, can you leave that out? You can, but then you can't call it a puttanesca. Oh, okay. okay. You can call it something else. Then, puttanesca but not without that. the anchovies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, you won't taste them. You can make. You, we're putting a few in now, but you can just put less. You don't. Even, I bet you, you don't even that. notice it. You, you wouldn't want exactly. want. Want. Just into the flavour. Yeah. That's all yeah. So yeah. then we're going in with the olives and capers. Okay, yep. and then a few chili flakes, oh, and this yeah. is the perfect dish for Valentine's Day because it's a natural aphrodisiac, just like we are. Oh okay? yes, we'll you really are. In the kitchen and in the bedroom. Aphrodisiac. Oh wow, I mean, <laughs> it's Valentine's Day. You got to eat every day is Valentine's Day, right? So yeah. we'll break these down once be. they cook off a little bit, and then we'll add in some passata. Okay, so actually we're going passata. with the first with the garlic. So we're going to add the garlic now instead, just because if you add it at the beginning, it's going to burn. So you want to add the garlic a little bit later just to cook yeah. off. Yeah. And we all say, like, up. being Italian, it's in our blood to cook. We used to remember watching our nonna when we was kids growing up. Yeah. It's all about family and food. She was always in the kitchen, always cooking. And that's, like, where our passion came from for the cooking. We was always eating together. Did she let you have table. a go? Did she let you both no, have a go? No, we used to always dip our bread into the pasta <laughs> and she'd catch us and chase us with a wooden spoon. Oh, that's so, so nice. Off. But that's, like, always <laughs> our family and food. That's what we're all about. Yeah. And food is passion. It's something you can't live without, like, love. Yeah. yeah. The most important ingredient you'll ever cook with is love. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's so what true. our nonna always taught us, and that's where our passion was born. Yeah. So, guys, do you do? Have you got a restaurant, or you? you we do a lot of cooking. So, obviously, we started on a little show called Love Island. No, you know, did, 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 did. <laughs> so, we were the original Italian stallions on the first ever series of that. Yeah. Um, and since then, we started our blog. And were you the first to get voted off Love Island? No, 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 no. That's a false. That's <laughs> false Is that true? true? Yeah, it's false for now. We, we just didn't like anyone on there. That was all it was. <laughs> oh, yeah. But yeah, um, so we've since then we started our blog, AlbertaTwins.com, and our YouTube cooking channel. Yeah, and then we've gone over to America quite a lot, and Canada do a lot of cooking TV shows. So out you there. were global now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We do a lot we're around. Yeah, going over to we America. We brought out our America. debut cookbook, Twintastico. If you haven't got it, go and get it. We'll yeah. get it. Um, and then we'll be bringing out our second cookbook later this year as well. And Good do luck. you go around people's houses and cook for them as well? We can come. Is that you asking for yourself, Is that Alex, you? then? Is that for asking, asking for a friend. We can come for a if you want. No problem. <laughs> Just out of interest. Yes. So, do you not Anytime, do that, then? No? Anytime. No. You do? Yeah, free of charge. At a cost. At a cost. So, so for you, Alison, free. Hey, anything. Yeah. <laughs> so with the sauce, I've added in some tomato puree, passata, and you just want to cook that off around 15 to 20 minutes, season it with some salt and pepper. Um, and then with the pasta, cook that until al, del al dente in boiling salted water, OK? Yeah. So you want it al dente, so it just means to the tooth, to the bite, OK? Yeah. Then you're going to finish it off into the sauce. I don't like when pasta's overdone. You don't it want it really mushy. Soft. 
Yeah. yeah. And we so, hate it when... So you're supposed to mix this and incorporate yeah. all the flavours together because we don't like it when the actual pasta's just put on yeah. a plonk and then put the sauce on top and plonk on top. You've got to make sure it's all mixed together. Yeah. So mix it all up together. Boys, what was it like being on that first series of Love Island? Because obviously we know the show now yeah. so well. It was amazing. Back then, sure. was it just... Yeah, you know, any know. idea what you signed up for? That's the thing. It was very raw <laughs> back then. It's, um, so it was very new to everybody. Obviously now it's a bit different, I imagine. But yeah, it was an amazing experience. We had a lot of fun on there. Did you, did you like, Good. both of you fancy the same woman? No. Yeah, we've got no. similar taste. We've similar taste, but not on the show. Yeah. yeah. Not on the show, we did it, no. What we'll about in real anyone. life? Do you fancy the same yeah. woman in real life? <laughs> we've, um, we've, we're, we're taking it at the moment, so... Yeah. Oh, if nice. you weren't, though, what kind of... <laughs> <laughs> if we weren't, yeah. Oh, we're really <laughs> happy yeah. to hear you, Tony. I'm so... Me. No, I'm happy for them. No, we are, are 100%. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, ladies, unfortunately. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, so you just want to mix the pasta together. Uh, okay. We are a little time then... to time. Can we make the cake as well? Yeah. Yes. So, we're going to be doing our naughty chocolate cake, and it's naughty because we're making it. Oh, yes. I'll so, bring some we're going in with our flour. Oh, thank you. Oh, that looks so nice. Cocoa powder. Thank you so much. We're going to mix these dry ingredients first. Come on, Baking powder. And our hazelnuts. So you want to mix the dry ingredients first, and then you go in with the wet ingredients. Yeah. yeah. And that's what we always say about Italian food, it's simplicity, you know. So a few little ingredients, yeah. seasonal fresh produce that you're going to cook together. You know, we want everyone cooking together as a family again, you know. This generation, we're not cooking together, so we grew up as a family cooking together, and that's what we're all Good. about now. So I'm going Good. with the eggs and the sugars that have been mixed <coughs> together, then we're going to have the, mm. the chocolate. Nice. And then you want to mix that together so it's nice and silky and smooth, just like we are. Italians love mm. cakes, don't they? Exactly. Yeah, yeah, we, yeah. Have it we love breakfast. the sweets. Yeah. Yeah. It's very sweet. Always the sweet stuff for breakfast, don't Exactly, yeah. yeah. Always. John, Tony, it's making me happy. Is it? Yeah, yeah that's this what we is want lovely. To would you that's throw, would you throw your doors open? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> of an evening. We aim to please. Come on. Absolutely, it's lovely. So you've got to mix the wet ingredients with the dry ingredients, mm -hmm. we're going to mix that together. Then you want to put it into the cake tin once it's done, into the oven at 180 for around 40 minutes, bring it out, let it cool, mm -hmm. and then we're going to That's top it... That's very important to let it cool at yeah. the time. We're going to top it with mascarpone, which is Italian cream cheese, yep. Nutella and icing sugar, yep. mix that together, and then we're going to slather it all over the cake, sprinkle with some hazelnuts to finish, and then that's it. It's a finish. perfect finish to a Valentine's Day night. Yeah. What a lovely together. cake, and here's it's pretty the... pretty easy to make, right? Yeah, 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 really yes. easy. That's what it's all about. We want to make um, cooking fun, you yeah. know, and working together. And easy. And easy. Yeah. Exactly, that's what it's all about, being together as a family, cooking together, and I think that's what we want to keep with the generations of the, the nonnas and things like that. And this is what the mixture will look like when you've mixed it together. This is okay. the topping and of the cake. The... Oh, that goes on block again. Oh, yeah, I'll do that for you. So that's mascarpone. ganache. Yeah, Chocolate sorry, sauce. What, and just all smooth it all, all over? Lather it all over there. And there's a little slice of the cake. Oh, my gosh. You'll be able to try that, that Dermot. I've oh, given chocolate up for Lent. Oh, gosh, so have I. <laughs> <laughs> we can just admire I joined it. you. Yeah, exactly. Mike, thank you so much over. for joining us. Thank, thank you, guys. Thank you. Details of today's recipe, check out uh, the this morning app. Yeah, time to head back to...